Well, um, I, I guess uh, you watched the O.J. stuff yesterday on TV, as everyone else did, Robin, but uh, the, the amount of evidence is piling up, and yet I wonder if black people on the street would still say O.J. is innocent. Uh, don't you think it's time to go back out? Yeah. I bet you black people still defend O.J. doesn't matter what you do. The DNA tests are not conclusive. Man, they set him up. <laughs> you out there stuttering, John? No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, he's already arguing. He's already arguing with black people. <laughs> Got any black people? All right, all right, hey. Yes. Yes. I'm, I'm right. Really? No. Yeah, I'm. I'm here with a black woman. What? Say hello. Hello. Hello, ma'am. How are you? I'm going to give her the headphones. Yeah. There you go. Hello, ma'am. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I'm doing a survey for the radio this morning. Um, uh, tell me, how do you feel about O.J. Simpson case? Oh, my God. <laughs> do you think he is guilty or innocent? I think it was framed. <laughs> now, tell her what happened later. Now, did you night. see the news last night that they, they actually found O.J.'s blood at the murder scene? I sure did. And you still feel he's framed? Yes. You feel that the police... Somebody took his blood to the murder scene? You mean somebody actually got his blood over there? I don't know how it happened, but that I do believe. Okay. There's been do, too do, many inconsistencies. Really? Like what? Well, you're putting me on the spot right now. And oh. You know, why are all black people defending OJ? I don't understand it. If, if you're a woman. It's not all black yes, people. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Of course it is. If I changed my color, would it make a difference? Yeah, you'd think he's guilty. <laughs> <laughs> Ma'am, let me ask you something. I'm really curious about this phenomenon of defending criminals. It's, it's, it's amazing to me that you would identify... Howard Stern. Yes. Yes. No one prepared me that I'd be on your show. Well, what's right. the difference? It's interesting. Howard Stern. Well, of course it's Howard Stern. Who else would you be talking to? I love your show. Thank you. I do. But I seriously, ma'am... Robin, I like you too. Thank and by you. the way, my name is Howard Stern. Isn't that what I said? You said Stern's. Without the S. Yes. Okay. Anyway, ma'am, what I am saying is this. It, it seems to me that for the police to go to all this trouble to frame O.J., of all people... I didn't say the police framed him. Oh, who framed him? I don't know. Oh, you think somebody else framed him? Yes, I do. O.J. has a lot of money, don't you think? He could hire detectives to find out the, uh, who framed him? Well, who would, who would well, be... I think they're working on it, aren't they? But what, what, what makes you believe this? I mean, it's, 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 why would O.J. be running from the law? Why would O.J. be uh, in this, high, this, uh, this low speed chase, if you will? And what about the wife battering and the fact that O.J. was stalking her? This doesn't lead you to believe that he's... I mean, how much, more, how much more evidence do you need that, oh, well, let's give up on him. And why, why do black people feel a need to defend this black man? It says he's just a man. And he's a man who is uh, guilty of crimes. It's obvious to everyone. Yet... I see uh, a lot of the black community OJ clinging, clinging to O.J., and I don't understand why. Explain it to why me. Why would there anybody are, frame him? Is it embarrassing? There are, there are a lot of whites saying that O.J. is innocent as well. We can't find well, him. I'm trying to find him. I haven't been able to locate any. You had to catch one going down the street. I just don't get this, this clinging to the O.J. thing. I just don't get it. I, I, in fact, Can as a woman... Can you honestly tell us why it is you feel O.J. is not guilty? Because he's black. No. Listen, I got to run because I'm late for work. Oh, hey, by the way, you're a woman, and a woman should at least identify with the battered woman syndrome that this poor woman was being, uh, getting her brains beat in. I think you should be happy O.J. will be off the street. Well, if O.J. did it, then he deserves to be punished, imprisoned, incarcerated, and all those things. But I'm what not, about the death I'm penalty? not convinced that he did it. And if O.J. did saying, do it, if O.J. did it, should he uh, get the chair? But definitely. Definitely. Definitely, he should. And by the way, I'm glad you have to go to work. It's great that you work. Congratulations. <laughs> I'm glad I have to go to work, too. Yes, good for you. Thank good for you. you. That's a good image. Okay. Good, good positive image reflected here on the radio. Even those little thought process uh, yeah, even though, adjustment there. Yeah, it absolutely <laughs> needs a little adjusting. But uh, very good for you. And uh, this, is, this is fun, Robin. I like talking to black yes. people this way from Let's here. Go on. Yes. I gotta run, Howard. Have a good day. Very nice to meet you, ma'am. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Very nice lady. You have a, uh, yeah, sometimes we do that. You have phone sex. <laughs> I got to hear that. Hello. Hello, how are you? I'm fine. Ah, uh, good ah. to speak with you, sir. Okay. And uh, where are you from? Uh, I'm from Africa. I said what part of Africa are you from? I knew it right away from your accent. Where are you from? Ghana. 
Ah, oh, Ghana. That is the deep. The great country of Ghana. The great country of Ghana. Yeah. What is the main export of Ghana? I don't even know. Do you know? My name in Ghana? Ghana Ria? No. <laughs> <laughs> what my, name, you... my name in Ghana is uh, uh, Kamanja. Kamanja. Yeah. All right, Kamanja. Let me t let me ask you something. Uh -huh. The O.J. Simpson case. You've been following it. Yeah. Okay. Guilty or innocent at this point? Uh, I think uh, this case is not. Uh, oh it's not O.J. OJ Simpson who caused this trouble. You don't think O.J. caused the trouble? Yeah. Who do you think did it? Uh, it can be anybody. <laughs> now, let me ask you something. Now, now oh, did you see... the only crime that could have been caused by anybody. Yeah, I mean, don't you think the, the evidence is unbelievable now that they found his blood at the murder scene? And, and yet black people are still holding on. Yeah, this blood, uh, the guy already said uh, he get it when he hear the wife, the dead, the death of, of, about the wife, uh, he got shocked about it. So yeah, but that blood was in Chicago. This blood was in Los Angeles. Yeah, they found the blood. You know where the woman was murdered? They found O.J.'s blood there. Did you know that? Uh-huh. Oh, you did know that? Doesn't matter to his argument. But you don't care. You still think <laughs> O.J. is innocent. Yeah, he's so innocent. Now, don't you think this is peculiar? I mean, you're from Africa, though. You don't have to defend O.J. I have to defend him. Why? Because you're a black guy? No. You feel that because he's a black man, you should defend him? No. Then why are you defending him? Uh, because, uh, you know, in this case, you, the way the case is going, you can't, you can't judge it, you know, because the evidence is not all right. They, they don't get the, uh, all the evidence. <laughs> they got more evidence than I've ever seen in any yeah, case in my life. they more evidence. They'll just throw out the books and put O.J. under the jail. Sure, they have tons of evidence. I don't understand why black people are holding on to this O.J. thing. I don't get it. Why? No, no, no. no. Yes. No, no, no. Now, what about you? What are you doing here in this country? You having a good time? Yeah, I'm having a good time. What, what do a, you do? What I'm, kind of work do you got? Uh, I work in a hotel. Oh, do you really? Yeah. Hey, and what about this uh, Ghana? I mean, that's I, I, what was it? What's their main export? Uh, Ghana, uh, Ghana has what? Parrot crap, I think. I don't know. What do they? What do they make over there? What do they make over there? Uh, we export cocoa. Oh, really? Cocoa. Uh -huh, cocoa and gold, diamond, bauxite, manganese. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, so why the hell would you leave there? Uh -huh. What is it? Is it very jungle-like? Is it like very deep, dark jungle? Yes. It is. So are the people very backward there? No, no. No? No. Don't they have any of those things? Ghana, Ghana is a... Uh, no, you know, Ghana is a country which uh, we are mature, you know. We know, yeah. we know life, you know. Yes. Because we, we were trained by the British people, you know. But do they have like, um, you know, like giraffes and elephants and water buffalo? Uh, no, we have we have some, but they are in the uh, jungle, you know. Yeah, unless, does anyone ever go in the jungle? Unless, unless you go to the deep forest, you know. And don't they have those guys with plates in their lips and all that kind of stuff? And the guys with the big stretched earlobes? No, no, no. None no. of that? You didn't see any giant of that spiders. while you were there? They don't they have, like, giant spiders? Uh, giant spiders? Yeah. What movies have you been watching? Uh, <laughs> they don't have any of that? Excuse me? I bet you got a wife over there, right? Yeah, yeah. I, get, I get a wife there. How many? How many wives you got? Uh, I have about three wives. No, come on. <laughs> <laughs> and what about, what about, seriously, you, you have a wife over there, right? Yeah, I love my wife over there. Yeah, and how and long? How long have you, have you been here? A lot of, a, a lot of guys, here, I know African guys, they come over here, they leave their wives there, they say, someday I send for you. 18 years. Yeah, how many years you been here without your wife? Three, uh, four? Uh, four years now. See? How and what, long was the last, when was the last time you saw her? Four years ago. Yes. Yeah. Really? You've never even been home. So you nail broads here and stuff, right? Uh, I trust my wife. She will never do nothing. Yeah, but what about you? Me? Yeah. I'm a, I'm a good guy, you know? Yeah, you have sex, though, with other girls. No, 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 no. Uh, Did your wife have a circumcision? No. You know what I mean? <laughs> Did you put a chastity belt on her before you left? No, no, no. And what tribe is she with? Uh, she said I can't. She's Akron? Akan, Akan. A Khan tribe? Yes. And what are you? I'm a Khan tribe too. Yeah, he don't believe in mixed marriage. I... <laughs> I'm in the Lakanuki tribe. Oh, I think he is too. Yes, yeah, so do I. You, so what are you doing? So when are you going to bring your wife over? Never? Yes. I oh. want to bring my wife here. When? You have children? Yeah, I have two children. You've never seen them? I see them. <laughs> they send them pictures. <laughs>
All right, very good. I'll see you there before I left. I ah, see. I see. I see. And, so they'll know who their father is. Yeah. But a lot, all the African guys come over here without their wife. And what do you do? You send money home? Yeah, I send money every, every day. Yeah, so what does she care? She's got a sucker working over here. And then she, she can... got a nice house over there. She's living here. And you don't think she's having sex with any of those native guys? No, no. Oh. She, don't, she don't do that. Keep dreaming. It's four years. Yeah. Why wouldn't she? She's got to be horny as hell. Excuse me? I say she's got to be horny as hell. She hasn't had it in, in four years? Yes. Yeah. Oh, man. She, she's waiting for me for four years. Wait wow. a minute. Do you have phone sex? <laughs> you have a, uh, yeah, sometimes we do that. You have phone sex? <laughs> I got to hear that. What are you wearing? What do you wearing? Uh -huh. I'm wearing loin cloth. <laughs> <laughs> me too. I'll tell you something. Uh -huh. You better be careful about that woman. I'm telling you, she's cheating. Oh, yeah? Oh, you absolutely. You have five what, what yeah, I bet you got five kids when you get home. <laughs> <laughs> what this? Three new kids. Hey, you ever see if, Tarzan? If, if I go home and she's cheating, I'm not going to follow her again. Hey, uh, you ever shrink a head? <laughs> you ever get it? What, what's your religion? My religion? Yeah. I'm a Christian. Oh, you are? Yeah. But didn't the white man come over and convert you to that? Yeah. Yeah. So, what were you before that? Voodoo. Uh huh. Yeah, I thought so. I know a lot about that. And you never shrunk a head or anything? Excuse me. You ever fire off a blowgun? No, 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 no. Did you have to kill a lion to prove your manhood? A lion? When you were thirteen, did you have to go into the jungle and kill a lion? No, no. Do you walk? I never see a lion in my life before. Do you have? Do you walk around on your bare feet so much that you have like houses that almost look like shoes? No, no. I was born in the city, you know. Right. <laughs> Did you ever get caught in a trap that grabs your foot and yanks you upside down? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> or one of those big nets that Whoa. just yeah. up with the tree. You never had that? No. <laughs> I can't believe it. Did you ever eat like elephant's testicles? No, I don't eat elephant. Nothing? Nothing, yeah. What do you eat? You ever eat zebra? Zebra? Yeah. No. We don't eat those kind of animals. Oh, okay. We don't know. How do we know? We see it on Tarzan. You yes. ever see Tarzan? I'm telling you that's true. Hey, what's Ungawa mean? Huh? Ungawa. Ungawa? Yeah. What's I, I don't understand the meaning of Ungawa. That's African. <laughs> Maybe it's a different, different country language. You, you know? never saw a Tarzan movie? No. How come they never saw a Tarzan movie? You never saw the movie about the white guy who was born in the jungle and he leads all the black people? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw that movie. Yeah, and he says Ungawa and all the black people follow him? Uh-huh. So it must mean something. No, you know... Uh, what does this mean? Uh, 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 uh. Does that make you want to do something? <laughs> you know... How come you're standing still when I do that? Uh, you know, uh... You're supposed to run. You know, like a wild man. In, in... <laughs> O.J. Simpson, guilty or innocent? Man, you killed that bitch, man. There you go. All right. Sir, yes. Where are you from, Africa? No, I'm from the Dominican Republic. Oh, you are from Dominican Republic. Right. <laughs> what, 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 you know, I don't even know that much about Dominican Republic. What, how come you left there? I thought it was supposed to be so great. It's great for tourists. Oh. It's all right, but it could be better, though. I heard the hotels are pretty good down there. Yes, they are. He didn't live in one of them. Yeah, why don't you just take advantage of the hotels and room service and, and stuff? Yeah. Well, my, my parents brought me here when I was very young. How old were you when you got indoor plumbing? <laughs> well, Let me ask you something. What about O.J.? You think he's guilty or innocent? Guilty. Ah, there ah. you go. Well, you're not really black. You're Dominican Republic. <laughs> you know, you're not, you're not a good example of a black man. Okay, so I'm going to put on the type back on. Yeah, you're almost white. <laughs> well, thank you. Uh, uh, Howard? Yeah. Can you just go to one more, please? One more, please. All right, quickly. Yeah, yeah, come here, sir. Just, yeah, you can you hear him? Yeah, I can hear you. Hello, sir. Hi, welcome to our airwaves. Hello? Sir, he's talking to you. Yeah, I can hear. Yeah, welcome. What you guys do on the street so early in the morning? Well, we, where are you from, Jamaica, my friend? Where are you from, Jamaica? I don't know if he can hear. Could you hear him? No. Yes, we can I hear. I hear music. Oh. He has music. Well, John has the wrong station to yeah, John, tune it to our station. I know, it's not like... Could you hear him now? Yeah, yes, I can hear him. Hey, how you doing? Uh, too early to tell. All right, uh, where are you from, Jamaica? Yeah, something like that. 
Yeah. Uh, what are you doing here? Well, what are you doing here? No, well, I'm a white guy. Well, uh, Where am I going to go? Oh, well, I'm a black guy. Where am I going to go? Let me ask you a question because you are a black guy. What do you think of the OJ case? Who is, is he guilty or innocent? I don't know. I think I lost him. No, 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 no. <laughs> go ahead, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. OJ Simpson, guilty or innocent? Man, you kill that bitch, man. There you go. Oh, All right. Wow. There you go. You see? See, Jamaicans know. Yo, he almost got away with it until that DNA thing come back. Right, now you know, right? Before yeah. you... Wait a minute. Did you have another opinion before the DNA? Well, um, more or less the same opinion. But right. I thought he had it pretty, pretty covered up good, but um, ah. I don't think so now. Yeah, now you think he's going to fry. Oh, yeah. All right, there you go. Thank you, sir. All right, Thank cool. You. you see, even uh, the black opinion is changed. But by the way, Jamaicans... Hey, sir? Hey, what? Let me say something. You don't consider yourself a black man. You consider yourself Jamaican, right? I consider myself a man. Yeah, but you know what I'm saying. The American blacks are very uh, uppity. Yeah. The Jamaicans are hardworking people, right? Something like that. Yeah. The Jamaicans. What do you do? Don't you think Jamaicans are better than the American blacks? Man, I don't think no man better than man. Just in um, character, you know? Yeah, but you know what I'm saying. Well, yeah, well, we're you talking know. about character. Yeah, I mean, in, in Jamaica, weren't you a, a medical doctor? No, man. As a ganja doctor. Oh, you were? <laughs> Of ganja. Ganja doctor, yeah. huh? Ganja doctor. But you know what I'm talking about. The, yeah, the Jamaican people have a war going with the American blacks. They feel that they are better. Because I grew up in a black neighborhood. Yeah, to a degree, you know. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, but, a, you know, I have a tendency to go past that, you know. Really? Yeah, man. Only, yeah, I don't. Only with small ganja, minds deal with that, you know. Yeah, I think the ganja makes you go past that. Well, you know, that helps too. Yeah. A little bit of this and a little bit of that, you know. So right. are you a Rastafarian? Well, that's what they say. <laughs> what is that, the guy who smokes pot all day? No, and they made a religion out of that. The guy, the guy who tried to live good with everyone every day, you know? What, what's your religion, by the way? Are you, I, are you into shrinking heads? No, man, I ain't in with that, no. You never did any of that? Did you ever put a voodoo curse on someone? That's fruitless, you know? That tree don't bear no fruit. Really? You know, it's in your mind. You believe that? No, I don't believe it. I'm just wondering. No, well, if you believe it, then it's going you know, it to it have a negative effect on you. Right. If, hey, you don't, if you don't believe it, then, you know. You got any rolling papers on you? Um, easy way, though. All right. Yeah. Thank you. All right. Yeah. All right. Excuse me, you have any guns on you? All right. Thank you, for your, thank you for your opinion. I appreciate it. There he is. That's a Jamaican guy who obviously sees the uh, O.J. guilty. Even through the smoke. Right. <laughs> O.J. Oh. Right, turning. Do me a favor, O.J. Would you put some bacon on your lap so it'll fry with you? Want me to call the O.J. Simpson line? Yeah, that's news. O.J. was in court yesterday and heard the real bad news from that prosecutor wearing her slinky white dress that the DNA tests show that O.J. O.J. was at the scene of the crime. Well, even though we went out this morning and asked black people now if they believe that O.J. is guilty. one 900 this is says here, we just got this fact. It's an O.J. Simpson line. It's $2.99 for a minute. <laughs> and you get the latest O.J. news, and then you can you leave... leave O.J. a message. You can leave O.J. a personal message. And all messages will be delivered to O.J. That's what he said. Yeah. I'm hmm. sorry. Your call cannot be completed as dialed. Please check the number and dial again. Hmm. Do you think it could have been... A1. Let me try it again. Yeah, maybe you missed dial. Would it be the first time? One nine hundred. OJ. Because if we can't do this one, you ought to call that other one and leave OJ a message. Yeah, I want to leave OJ a message. <laughs> I wish they'd have OJ record the message. Thank you for calling the news line of New York. This line is updated daily and as the news changes. News line is currently featuring the OJ Simpson case. The cost of this call is ninety-five cents per minute, two ninety-nine for the first. Oh, that's not a ripoff. If you disconnect at this time, you will not be billed. OJ's on TV every minute. Please press one now to hear the latest update in the OJ Simpson case, or press two now what to leave a personal message to be delivered to oh, OJ Simpson. You don't want to hear the latest news. What is? What could they possibly be saying? Uh oh, looks bad for our boy. <laughs> Tell O.J. Simpson what you think about the case. Please begin speaking at the tone. Remember, press the star key when finished. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'd like to leave this message for O.J. O.J., you're going to jail forever. You better get used to those surroundings. In case you haven't uh, realized what went on in court, because you look like you're in a haze. 
That uh, that blood sample is yours. The DNA. T I even think black people think you're guilty now. We even found some black people on the street that think you're guilty. The tide is turning. Do me a favor, O.J., would you put some bacon on your lap so it'll fry with you? Oh. All right? Thank you. Press the star. Oh, Don't right. get a raise. Right. Is that right? I'll get a raise? I hope not. I just want to make sure we follow all the rules. Well, there it is. I guess I'm done. Yeah, you don't hear anything else. No, that's it. Think O.J. will get the message? They said all messages would be delivered. You didn't even tell him who you were. Oh, I'm not going to say who I am. Are you crazy? What if he gets out? Kick my ass. Oh, come on. All right, we'll see you tomorrow. Wow, was that great? It was, wasn't it? Guess what? We've got another Celebrity Phil show coming up in seconds. So quick, run to the fridge and get yourself a snack right now. Hurry. Don't go anywhere. <laughs>